And I think, well, I was off sick nine months into the job, like thinking, A, I just don't want to continue anything, but B, I just want to get as far away from that place as possible. And then something said to me, but what about the next Chantal that walks into that force? What is she going to go through? And that voice was the reason that I wrote a really comprehensive report describing what happened. That report was then crimes, and although nothing happened, it was a piece of evidence that showed how systemic racism operates within the force. And going back in and saying, actually, do you know what? I'm not going to keep quiet about what's happening. This is what's happening. This is what your officers are doing to people like me and to women. And I want you to do something about it. That was actually my first activist act because I was standing up in rooms full of white people who were all telling me it was in my head. Going, no, it's not in my head. This is a real issue. And do you know what's interesting? I actually have a friend yeah. that has got a similar description to you. Yeah. And a very similar experience within the yeah. police force. 